Hey, what's up, guys? Don the six oh five here, and uh, today, uh, you know, I have a reason a reason to make this video uh, really interesting. Well, what if I told you that uh, GTA is so old, by the way, Rockstar, that now you can now emulate your game, and <laughs> it's not even a six one. So recently, I came out with uh, I was trying this thing called RPCS three, which. Uh, Basically, is a, uh, a emulator for the play PS3. And I was thinking, I'm too lazy to actually uh, uh, plug in the P PlayStation 3. So I thought, you know what? Just emulate it. So, yeah, you can see, like, the, uh, when we actually get into this video, like, you can see that we'll have a bunch of stuff to talk around. And there's a lot of good stuff into it, too. Like, if I go into, uh, let's say, uh, configuration and then it's CPU. Uh, I have interpreter shaders, uh, accurate X float, um, and then we have the uh, recompiler LLVM. If I go to my GPU, I'm using Vulkan with the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4060 and uh, with the resolution scale to 300%. I want you to know uh, the PlayStation ran at 720p at, uh, at its time. Now, uh, because this is actually running at 300% of its resolution scale, uh, it runs under, uh, like, under 4K, essentially. I also have async shaders, right color buffers, and V-Sync. If I, ha I had to also go into advanced, and, uh, if I didn't actually go into, to, uh, turn on accurate RSX uh, reservation access, and if, and turn on the RSX FF, uh, FIO uh, FFO accuracy to atomic the game kept freezing on me. Yeah emulation isn't perfect But for starters, this is actually one of the good-looking emulators out there And uh, I also have the uh, network on so I can actually like play with other people online with that as well uh, Let's hit let's close and let's hit start So as you can see the game kind of runs really fast to be honest so because we're actually like running this on an emulator, the game doesn't even take time to boot. It just like starts right off the way. And yeah, I see. Look at this, cache shaders and everything. Uh, but building SPU cache. Yeah. So that's uh, that's basically the game you're just trying to load and the shaders at some point. It's actually really interesting. Let's uh, let's uh, kind of come on. Successfully logged. Yeah, you can see that I'm logged in. Also, I'm running the, uh, the, uh, yeah, we even got this. So even when, we even got the, uh, 1.6 version, which actually is, uh, the uh, uh, version that R Rockstar Games ran online services on, which actually is kind of bonkers how they kept that up for some reason, but they didn't, uh, because GTA Online was dead, let alone except for the fact that you can run older versions to play online anyways. So... Yeah, uh, I'm gonna run story mode just so I can like uh, see how this runs per se because I want to like show you guys the online perspective of it. I'm not gonna go through the prolong, but I want to like show you guys how this runs. It looks pretty nice. Oh yeah, we even got the prolong and everything. All right, so so we go to online and we can actually see, you can see that the shaders kind of like had some trouble with game uh, Michael's face there. Uh, but yeah, it's uh, yeah. When you see like this, it just shows that the cloud servers are unavailable. That doesn't mean it's impossible to play. So I could put basically just like do a an invite only session. I, I normally would only go solo, but then again, it just removes some of the features. If you see in the bottom left, it shows like piling shaders. That just shows that like uh, some of the gameplay elements are actually like trying to be shaded through. And yeah, we're literally playing GTA Online on uh, a base emulator. <laughs> this is actually nuts. Yeah, you can see some stutters there and there. Oh my god, we're literally running it. So yeah, you can see like the way it's compiling the shares. I might turn up the gamma a little bit so I can see better. Actually, no, yeah. Yeah, it's better. All right. 
So I might. I, so as you can see, like the game actually runs pretty smooth. Like even on like 4K resolution, hey, how's it going? the NPCs are walking and everything. The car Did traffic is there. Just everything. Oh my god! Even the menu looks really weird. Like very different. Even the map layout. Well, like if you look at the map, it looks like the old PlayStation 3 thing. Whereas before, it looked like the uh, good old uh, old-fashioned thing where it's like, you know. But yeah, this is literally GTA 5 on an emulator online. Why is this guy following me? Turn off the copyright music. Headshot. <laughs> oh. Sorry, I just need this bike. That's all I need. So yeah, you can literally see like. Am I able to call Lester? Can't handle the heat, my friend. Okay, leave it with creepy Uncle Lester. I don't like how you just called yourself creepy. But I'll roll with it. Oh, okay, even the ragdolls are really good. Jesus Christ, I did not mean to do that either way. Oh Jesus! The the drifting in this is really nice. Are you looking? Yeah, can we do that? No. But that's not a jump. Oh man, I'm getting like so attached to this. This is like actually really good. Right, can we Oh, head first. Oh, okay. the reaction of everyone who's like, ah! <laughs> uh, Jesus Christ, everyone was like seeing that, like, they witnessed something terrible, even though they technically did. Uh, oh, hello, Mr. Carr. Is that, is that free free to go? Oh, wow. Yeah, really good, ain't it? Yeah. Wait till I ran. Okay. Whoa! Oh, even that explosion is good. <laughs> Where are you running to? Hmm. I'm smelling burnt tires around here somewhere. Yeah, there it is. Well, here lies the remains of me. Only I had some. Oh. Okay, how are you gonna get around that? Interesting. So the yeah, AIs do know how to get around that. What the? <laughs> No. What the? The frick is it? 
There you go. I had to press share to get that to work. I don't know why it's not freaking crossbar. It's share. What? What? Since when was the menu share? Yeah, that makes sense. They will pass the mode. That don't work. Not against other modders, it don't. Oh, now I have no bullets. I have nine. In that truck. If anything, we're just doing this. But, then again, emulation itself is great. So, I think I'm going to leave this episode here. This has been a great chunk of introduction towards uh, emulation. I really want to play more of this. This is really fun. I might actually see if I can go through the story mode and play the whole thing again. But I want to see if I can, like, if I actually try this really good enough, I might actually get to, like, the credit screen with uh, just this amount of, like, emulation testing. To see if, like, this my computer can really handle this kind of emulation. Because I really like this emulator. This is a really good one. Let alone being one of the better ones out there that actually just, like, do things pretty good. But yeah, if you like what you saw, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, and comment. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out. Bye.